Hey guys, Dalton with Jaspertronics, and today we're going to be taking another look at these Sony 4K projectors. We're actually going to be talking about this maintenance hatch that they have underneath the lens. This is the front of the projector right here. This is where the actual image projects out from, right here. And underneath the lens is a maintenance hatch that a lot of people don't even know exists. So let's talk about it a little bit today, and uh, let's get started. <laughs> The big thing about this maintenance hatch is that it has like three or four fans underneath it. And these fans are what help keep this projector cool. They're incredibly important fans. And most of the time, something like this would have like an air filter in front of it. These don't. These don't have an air filter at all. So these are held in by two screws. Let's get these popped off and I'll show you what's inside. All right, and then that lifts just right off there and then we can actually see our fans inside of here. So the first fan that I wanna point out is this one right here. This is one of your main like intake fans um, for like what is essentially the optical block, the optical engine, whatever you wanna call it. The main thing that controls your screen. Um, these are very important and there is actually another fan right underneath it, right there. So there are two fans right here. So those fans are very important. You wanna make sure that those get cleaned out. The best way to clean out this unit whenever you have it opened up like this and you're inside of this maintenance hatch is to vacuum this out. You don't wanna blow the dust further inside of the unit. You don't wanna blow the dust inside of the unit at all, really. Um, and the only way to avoid that is to have this top opened up whenever you're accessing this. So. Really, whenever you're inside this part of the projector, the only thing you can do is vacuum it out. You can't blow it out. The only time you can blow it out is whenever you have the rest of the projector opened up, which I plan on going over in my next video. So, the next thing to look at is this fan right here. This fan is held in by two screws, and it's actually got a wire attached to it where it runs to its power source. That's where it gets power from. And... That particular cable we're not going to be able to remove today. Um, it, we, we can't get to it from where it's at. So this thing is actually just going to kind of float in place right here. But as you can see, you can easily access it, get it all cleaned out uh, very easily just from right here. You don't have to do much more than this. So once you have access to all of this, these fans right here, this is pretty much everything that you can do from right here. This fan, as you can see, it's... It's outside of the unit. You can blow this one out, that's fine. You can get this one fully cleaned out that way. These are harder to clean out uh, just by vacuuming them out. Um, if they are seriously dusty, if you're seeing some serious fuzz on these, it might be time to look into getting your unit serviced. Um, these projectors are starting to have problems because of this dust, because of this lack of an air filter right here. And uh, it's really starting to cause some issues with some of these units. So. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below. Uh, if you like the video, definitely leave a like. Uh, I'm going to have more videos coming out on these uh, Sony 4K units now that I've got one in that I can work with, kind of tinker with, and show you guys what these things are doing and try to help keep them out of a landfill. So uh, thanks again for watching. We'll see you in the next one, and uh, later, guys.